Hey guys, I'm here with Gemini and I have an exciting, exciting news that I would like to share with you guys. So I thought I would go ahead and make it into a video. Um, but first, I'm really sorry for my voice. Um, I don't know how I come across on video, but I'm just getting over a cold. Um, and today was like the first day ever I got to do anything with my dolls. Um, so, <laughs> so even though I sound probably sick, I decided to go ahead and make a body review video and also this updating video. So please excuse my voice. Um, so as far as the exciting news, I actually, the bottom line is, <laughs> I actually got a new doll and I have an incoming doll which is really, really exciting because I have been wanting this doll for a very long time, but I never thought um, I would ever own her. Um, I don't know why, but I never thought that I could ever own this doll because she is loved by so many people and um, they just make them look really nice. And I, I just never thought that I could just bring her home and... Um, I don't know, I just really never um, imagined that I would own one until about a week ago I stumbled upon this um, sales thread on Den of Angels because I've been going in there a lot to update my stuff, um, some of the stuff that I'm selling and some of the dolls that I'm looking for a new home to. Um, so I've been going in and out of Den of Angels quite a lot and I just kind of stumbled upon this doll and I was like, oh my goodness. Um, but at the time, I just didn't know if I really want to bring her home because I do have lots of dolls that I'm looking for a new home to. I just felt like it's not right time um, to bring another SD doll, that is. Um, so I decided to go ahead and pass on it. But you know how it happens once it's like stuck in your head um, it's just kind of that's the only thing you can think about so that's just kind of been happening for you know past few days and I just finally decided okay um, since she's not really readily available and I really like the this particular version of this doll um, I will go ahead and just contact the seller and see what happens. <laughs> so I contacted the seller and we talked about it and I decided to go ahead and bring her home. Um, and like I said, she's a sculpt that is just loved by so many people. Um, and I'm really hoping that she will work with me too because I feel like she does, her sculpt does have very special quality um, that I've been really admiring um, through a lot of other people's work. So I'm really hoping that I, I will be able to kind of make her my own as well and see where it takes me. So um, I actually decided to only keep two SD dolls um, in my collection at least, um, which was Gemini and also Nabi, who is the Feeble 60 Moline Celine. But I guess after all, I'm going to have the third um, SD girl. So I'm really excited and scared at the same time. Um, but yeah, so I think it's time to tell you guys which sculpt I got. <laughs> um, she is from Lutz. Um, she's the Lutz Delph, I guess, Lutz CP Delph Miu. <laughs> um, and normal skin and I believe she was made in 2011 so she's relatively um, you know not too old um, but she is from the um, CP in when when they were with Lutz I believe um, so she does have a slightly different um, even though it's the same sculpt as the Fairyland Feeble 60 Mew, um, I feel that whenever I get more like gravitate towards um, a Mew photos, they were always the Delph, um, uh, Lutz Delph Mew. So um, that's why I never thought I would actually own this doll because I, you know, I don't see that doll coming available, um, you know. Um, on Den of Angels a lot so I just never really thought I would own one but I'm really hoping that I could make this doll my own as well I know she's getting loved by lots of lots of you um, 
so I'm really, really excited. Um, and the time was, I guess, um, somewhat perfect because I did get to rehome some of my dolls, so I did have enough fund um, to actually purchase her. So, and I already, I mean, I was doing a lot of going through stuff, as you guys know, and I found some of the stuff that I think when she arrives, I will be able to put on first. Um, so I'm going to show you those um, here. Ah, I'm so excited. Um, so this one is pretty famous little jumper, and it is the um, SMP jumper, um, quilted jumper, and I really have been loving this. Um, and I just received these not too long ago. And I, I love the fact that it has a pocket here. It's so, so cute. So this little number. And also, I'm going to have her in this jean. Washed out nine style jean. Um, I had this for a very long time, actually. Um, so she's going to wear that. And then she's going to wear um, this shoes. And I believe this is from 99 style as well. Um, she does come with the custom face up, but I think um, once I get her, I'm going to do her um, face up myself and see um, what happens. I haven't decided on her hair yet. Um, I really want something different, different for her and... Um, I don't know, I really want to try like a totally different colored wig, but at the moment I am kind of in a buying band mode um, of the things until I, you know, I can just move things a little bit more. So I don't think I'm going to buy things right away for her. That's why I kind of dug through some of the stuff that I already had um, as far as her outfits go. So I think she's going to wear um, a wig that I have until I can figure out what I really want for her. So I'm not going to be purchasing um, new wigs or eyes for her until I get her. Um, and then until I get to move some more stuff and create a little more fund for um, the stuff that I want for her probably. So yay! <laughs> um, I'm just really really happy. Um, hopefully I'll be able to do a box opening when she arrives. Um, I don't know if she's going to be able to ship her out um, tomorrow or sometime next week. So hopefully soon I will be able to see her in person. Um, yep, <laughs> so that's the big news, guys. So I hope you guys are having a great weekend, and I hope to talk to you guys later. Bye!